So we got seven Plymouth Barred Rock hens. Got these last August. They're not, they're about, uh, what does that make them like? 10 months old now. Got them as little chicks. They came in a little bitty box through the U.S. mail. And uh, so we raised them as baby chicks. Made a brooder out of a tote. I'll probably have to do a have to do another video on that later on. But made a cut out the top, put some wire across it, and of course, and raised them in that tote in the house for probably the first month until they got big enough. And we got this commercial little chicken house here. But it got to be where we got, even here in town, we got predators. Raccoon and possum, feral cats, hawks. And so we built a uh, Fort Apache here. Which is uh, pretty simple construction. It's basically just a 4x4 four by four, four by four cube. Clean out door here on the side. Door for them to go in and out of in the front. And uh, water inside. Three nesting boxes are made out of milk crates and a perch ladder for them. And they do just fine. We get about them. We get about anywhere from five to seven eggs a day, and they are some good eating. I mean, really good eating. A lot better than the eggs you get in the store. Right, girls? What do you think, huh? People ask me, do you have them all named? I'm like, no. I can't tell one from another. They're all marked the same, but they're not too different in size, so I just call them Bertha, Ethel, Mavis. Hey, you. What? what? Careful what you're saying now. I said, hey, you. Oh, hey, you. Yeah, we say, call them hey, you. Hey, you one, hey, you two. But they're creating a lot of good fertilizer. For the raised bed and the compost pile over there has never done so well. So between that and worm castings, we're doing well. And that's all I got to say about that. See you on the next one.